Welcome back. I'm Jamison Euler live inside Ball Arena in Denver, Colorado, where preparations are underway for game one of the Stanley Cup final tomorrow night. The team just wrapping up their media day a short time ago. So let's bring in our sports team now who are there with the team during that media day. Guys, what was the message that came out of there? Uh, is a message, lowercase m, maybe message. Yes, tomorrow night, the two-time reigning champion Tampa Bay Lightning dropped the puck in game one of the Stanley Cup final against the Colorado Avalanche. And we might, might see Bolt star center Braden Point back on the ice. Yeah, Point has not played since May 14th. He's recovering from that lower leg injury, but he's getting closer each day. And I noticed he's the third player on the ice during practice today, so that's a pretty good sign. Again, a full participant. He's making all the cuts, going full speed. He looks really good out there. Head coach John Cooper says there's a chance that Point will be in the lineup in game one, if not game one. A very good chance he's in there on Friday for game two, or Saturday, rather, for game two. Point says his body will let him know when he's ready to go. If this series goes well, I think you could you could. But we're also we're not just when you think about our the past ten years, you know, we've been in the conference finals plenty of times. We've gone to the finals a bunch of times. It's not just winning for three years, but it's everything that comes along with that. And I think if we do, I think you could be put in that conversation. Well, is there really a definition for dynasty? That's what we asked uh, Alex Kalorn, who you just heard from. He played his college hockey at Harvard, so he knows what it's like up close and personal. How many championships in a row over how many years? How do you figure conference final and final appearances? Uh, Kalorn isn't saying this current team isn't a dynasty. Double negative alert. But I've also heard stronger denials, and hopefully uh, we discussed Braden Point earlier. You said making all the cuts. He looks good. He looks like he's in good spirits. Everyone's smiling. The team looks loose. And hopefully we get to number 21 back on yeah, the ice tomorrow. Yeah, points that he didn't want to go in the lineup when he wasn't fully healthy. He didn't want to hurt the team. He saw the boys are doing well. They got the win against the Rangers in game six. So all is good. We'll talk more about winning tomorrow. We have a whole hour-long special quest for the cup that begins at 7 o'clock. For an hour live in Denver, that's Kevin. I'm Kyle. We'll send it back to you in the studio. All right. Well, all three get back together here tomorrow night, guys. Thanks a lot. Okay, we are your official Stanley Cup station here at ABC Action News. We're with you every step of the way in the quest for the Cup. The Stanley Cup Finals air right here on ABC this year. I'm going to be in Denver along with Kevin and Kyle, our sports team there. We're going to bring you a live pregame special, as they mentioned, tomorrow night at 7 o'clock right here on ABC Action News. You can catch it right here and on our streaming news channel, ABC Action News Plus, And you can find that for free on Roku, Amazon Fire TV, and Apple TV. But for now, I'll send it back to you guys in Tampa, live from the big mason jar, Ball Arena. <laughs> Jamison Euler, ABC Action News. All right, Jamison, thank you. Yeah, can't wait for game one. It's going to be exciting as we check.